So Ovi gets his 30th of the season. What a time to get it to in the game. Seven ticks left on the second period clock in Detroit. A historic goal as well, reaching 30 goals in a season for the 18th time <laughs> most in NHL history. And I also mentioned earlier in the show, Coach, I did like that he passed Mike Gartner, another former capital, to get to that number last night. What a goal, what a career, and, you know, obviously huge in a game that you guys needed last night. Yeah, the the time of the goal was it, it couldn't have been bigger for um, us going into the <clears throat> intermission into the third period there and, and being up one, but to give us that second to to give us a bit of a cushion going into the third because we knew they were going to press and they were going to um, come after us. So I think that settled us a little bit. Huge moment there, and to to make that play like you, you know some people look at it like ah it's it's th those chances last night there's probably 10 of those looks but but he's the guy that um finds a way to put one in the back of the net in those situations and that that speaks to what he's done his entire career scoring goals like that finding ways to beat goaltenders clean and in big moments so it, it couldn't have been couldn't have come at a bigger time for our group for sure and it was awesome to have osh back on the ice last night he was a game time decision after missing the last four games he gets the assist on that ov goal with a quick turnover in the neutral zone he sees ov streaking down the left side of the ice next thing you know ov snaps it past the, the goalie you guys go in with a two nothing lead as you as you mentioned instead of just a one nothing lead huge yeah and and Osh is he's such an important part of our team for for so many different reasons that we've talked about, and and you could argue, um, like obviously Johnny Carlson is a, a massive part of our team and um, so important. Oh, same thing, really important player. But you can put Osh right up there with those two guys on um, how valuable they are to our lineup every night and Osh is a little bit of a different not just because of the minutes he plays but just the calming presence the bench um, his his um, demeanor and how he talks to our players and and his play on the ice is just so poised and he can make plays off the walls and so anytime he's not in our lineup um, we as a coaching staff like we walk away from the games win or lose or whatever happens and, and we feel it we can feel when he's not in. So having him back, uh, huge impact, and we and we felt it last night. Chucky was spectacular last night. Hang that performance in the loo. Yeah. Put it behind bulletproof glass. <laughs> do whatever you, you have to do to protect him. He, he stopped 2.19 more goals than expected. That's according to moneypuck.com. Can you quickly explain that stat to the hockey noobs that you're talking to right now that don't know all of those fancy analytics because yeah. that seems like an impressive number to me it, it is and, and essentially what happened was uh in the first probably so first period and then about 12 minutes into the second like we we had a few looks but they definitely carried the play and out chanced us so had the better of the scoring chances um through that part of the game and chucky made call it eight to ten really really quality saves that you could argue um you know there's a good chance those go in but he he makes a great saves in those spots and he keeps that game at zero zero and so once again similar to so like a few weeks ago maybe it was against winnipeg like chucky keeps that game at zero zero lets us find our footing um you know we, we would like to um carry a little bit more play than we did but we hung on hung on hung in there chucky makes some big saves and then the second period towards the end about eight minutes left we start to um and whether it was like you could chalk it up to them they push real hard in their own building and then they run out a little bit of gas and now we take over momentum and take over the game or or you know get those two goals and put ourselves in a good spot and chucky's a huge reason for that because if, if you're down in that spot it becomes a lot more challenging.